Hello friends, this video on body movements part 19 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. So the next organism that we will discuss is a snail. So let's introduce snail. So when you look at the body of a snail, they have soft unsegmented body. So no segmentation in their body and also the body is quite soft. Now something special about the snail is this shell which they carry over them. So when you look at a snail, you will see this kind of a big structure over their back. So it seems as if they are carrying this big structure. So this structure is called shell and it is made up of calcium carbonate. So it is like an, uh, you can say it is like a skeleton on the outer side of the body. So it is not that just for fashion it is carrying this shell. The shell is like the skeleton. So it, it is uh, a structure which is an outer covering of the body. So the shell is an outer covering of the body. So it provides protection and the shell keeps growing as the snail grows. So the size keeps on increasing until the snail reaches the size of an adult. After that it doesn't grow any further. So that's about the shell. So this is a coiled structure over their body. So it, it looks exactly like this. So if you have not seen a snail so just try to see it maybe mostly you can see it on pictures or it is also available in different types of climates so sometimes you can also see it now how do snails move so when it comes to movement snails move at a very very slow speed so if when compared to earthworm these snails move even slower than them so let's see how do they move so they have a muscular foot which helps in movement. So this is the muscular foot. So this muscular foot is such that it can rest on the ground and then with the help of muscle contraction, it can gradually make the organism move. So not only this, uh, they also secrete a slimy substance called mucus. So mucus is a slimy and slippery substance that is secreted which protects the uh, muscular foot from any kind of mechanical injury because when it is moving on a surface there might be sharp objects, there might be some rough areas on the surface. So the muscular foot might get injured. So to protect from such injuries these slimy substance makes the surface smooth. And that's how they, they protect their body parts and also it helps in easier movement. Because have you ever seen that when you tend to walk on a slippery surface, what happens? You tend to fall down because it is very slippery. So that means walking becomes easy on a slimy surface. But then some, if the surface is too smooth, we tend to fall down. So the same is true here. So when the surface is made slippery, movement becomes easy. So that is what is being done here. And due to the secretion of this mucus, wherever you see a snail moving, you would see a trail. You would see a line of this mucus behind because the, as it is moving, uh, this mucus is being secreted. So this trail of mucus is known as the slime trail. This is called the slime trail. Thank you. Please visit www.examfear.com to watch more educational videos with a better experience. Please do not forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel for latest updates. Thank you once again.